step into the rugged world of the Big Valley, a 1965 TV series that captivated audiences with tales of the Barclay family navigating the challenges of the Old West. No need for fancy words, it's all about grit and determination. Ever wonder about that one scene that left you wide-eyed? Or perhaps, when did you first saddle up with them? Hold on tight because there's a trove of funny, shocking, and sad facts waiting for you in the episodes ahead. So keep those eyes peeled. Now, let's dig into your memories. What's your most cherished moment? Was it a heart-pounding showdown or a tender family moment? We're all ears, eager to hear your stories and experiences down in the comments below. No need for nostalgia, just share what's etched in your mind. And remember, the journey through the Big Valley isn't just about the Barclays, it's about your journey too. So, what's your story? Share it with us and let's keep the spirit of the show alive. The Big Valley is a television series that garnered attention for its unique take on the Western genre. While I wasn't initially drawn to Westerns, this show managed to capture my interest both in the 1970s and during its recent run on the Hallmark Channel. The ensemble cast, featuring notable actors like Barbara Stanwyck, Richard Long, Peter Brecht, and Lee Majors, brought depth to the characters. It's worth noting that Richard Long's absence is felt, especially for those who remember him from Nanny and The Professor. The series, unfortunately, had a relatively short run of four years. Some critics have labeled The Big Valley as a Western soap opera primarily aimed at female viewers. It's been likened to a derivative of the successful Bonanza with noticeable differences in character dynamics to appeal to a broader demographic. The show introduces a female movie star, three sons with distinct personalities, and an airhead daughter, creating a family dynamic that attempts to cater to different viewer preferences. Criticism has been directed at the show's tendency towards melodrama, characterized by loud acting and unsubtle characterizations. Critics also point out the reuse of worn-out plots, such as brides to be being murdered and conveniently induced amnesia. The presence of bad people causing trouble for the Barclays, only to meet their demise in the last five minutes, has been noted as a recurring pattern. Despite its flaws, there is acknowledgement that the series improved in subsequent seasons, featuring occasional solid episodes. However, some still draw parallels to Bonanza without considering it a compliment. The rise of cable TV is cited as a factor that led to the demand for programming, sometimes resulting in the hiring of talented writers and directors whose work may have been deemed too good for broadcast television. In conclusion, The Big Valley is a show that has evoked mixed reactions from viewers over the years. While some appreciate its unique approach to the Western genre and the ensemble cast performances, others criticize it for melodramatic tendencies and recycled plotlines. Set against the backdrop of the Old West, the TV show found its place alongside Lancer, both unfolding in a parallel reality during the same time period. The series weathered the passage of time, and with the passing of Peter Breck in 2012 and Charles Bryles in 2016, only two enduring cast members, Lee Majors and Linda Evans, remain from the original lineup, each boasting over 20 appearances. Among the Barclay family, Audra consistently attracted unconventional suitors, adding a layer of unpredictability to the narrative. With the recent departures of Breck and Bryles, Majors and Evans stand as a testament to the enduring spirit, keeping the legacy alive. Its unique take on the Western genre captured diverse audiences, featuring an ensemble cast that included renowned actors like Barbara Stanwyck, Richard Long, Peter Breck, and Lee Majors. Despite its relatively short four-year run, it managed to leave an indelible mark on viewers, even gaining renewed attention during reruns on the Hallmark Channel. Critics, however, labeled it as a Western soap opera, drawing parallels to Bonanza. The family dynamic, featuring a female movie star and three distinct sons, aimed to cater to a broad demographic. While some criticized it for melodramatic tendencies and reused plots, there is acknowledgement that it improved in subsequent seasons, delivering occasional solid episodes. In the evolving landscape of television, it faced mixed reactions. Some appreciated its unique approach and ensemble cast performances, while others were critical of its flaws. Despite its shortcomings, it stood as a representation of a bygone era in television, navigating the challenges of the Old West with grit and determination. Barbara Stanwyck, the lone Emmy nominee among the leading cast, secured her nomination streak across the first three seasons, clinching her first win. Her outstanding contribution to the series marked a noteworthy achievement. The Emmy recognition underscored her role as a pivotal force in the narrative. 
Victoria, portrayed by Stanwyck, rode alongside her trusted horse, Misty Girl, while Nick, played by Peter Breck, had his companion in the form of Coco. The bond between the characters and their horses added an authentic touch to the Western setting. A notable aspect of the Big Valley was its distinction as the inaugural four-star production series filmed in color. This shift to color marked a significant stride in television production, enhancing the visual experience for viewers and setting the show apart from its predecessors. The decision to film in color brought a vibrancy to the rugged landscapes and characters of the Old West, elevating the overall viewing experience. This move demonstrated a commitment to innovation, showcasing the series' adaptability to changing industry standards. In retrospect, the Big Valley stands as a trailblazer not only for its compelling narrative, but also for embracing technological advancements in television production. The color format, coupled with the stellar performances of the cast, contributed to the series' enduring legacy in the Western genre. Victoria Barclay, the matriarch of the Barclay family in the TV series, stands out as the only member never to face a gunshot throughout the show's run. In contrast, Heath experiences the most gunshot incidents while Nick endures two shots in a single episode. The perilous tales of the Barclays unfold against the backdrop of a familiar jailhouse set shared with the renowned Gunsmoke series. A striking detail emerges from the opening credits, where the exterior shot of the Barclay house is the same iconic house used as Tara in Gone with the Wind. This subtle connection to a cinematic classic adds a layer of intrigue to the series, reinforcing its place in the broader cultural landscape. The series' commitment to authenticity extends beyond its narrative elements. Barbara Stanwyck, the sole Emmy nominee among the main cast, secured her nomination streak and clinched her first win, underscoring her pivotal role in the narrative. Victoria, portrayed by Stanwyck, navigates the challenges of the Old West alongside her trusted horse, Misty Girl. In parallel, Nick, played by Peter Breck, forms a bond with his equine companion Coco, adding an authentic touch to the Western setting. A notable aspect of the Big Valley is its distinction as the inaugural four-star production series filmed in color. This pioneering decision enhances the visual experience for viewers, marking a significant stride in television production. The shift to color brings vibrancy to the rugged landscapes and characters of the Old West, setting the series apart from its predecessors and showcasing adaptability to changing industry standards. In retrospect, the Big Valley stands as a trailblazer not just for its compelling narrative, but also for embracing technological advancements in television production. The color format, coupled with stellar performances, contributes to the series' enduring legacy in the Western genre. The legacy endures, with Lee Majors and Linda Evans as the only remaining cast members from the original lineup, embodying the enduring spirit of the Big Valley.